I can't tell you how many things I dropped for a guy. When a girl grows up with a hundred movies singing the tune of true love and happy endings found through a wedding band, well, what else should I be looking for? I would do almost anything to find my happy ending. I got really good at reading a guy. I'd find out what he was looking for in a girl and mold myself around that image. I could drop my personality, my friends, my dreams. It didn't matter if that's what he wanted. It never worked very well. Either the guy I was with fell in love with a person who didn't exist, or he never fell in love at all. I remember all their faces. No, okay, if I'm being honest, it's their bodies I remember. We shared a bed and I'd say all the right things and then I'd be gone. At first I thought, all guys do it, right? But you can't travel down that path for long before the guilt begins to catch up with you. Why do I keep doing this? Every time I think, this time it's for real. This time I know he loves me. And then I wake up and I'm staring at the wall and he's changing. He's disappointed. He's gone. I tell myself I don't care because if I keep saying it, maybe I'll finally start to believe it. I shouldn't be here, but it's all I know. We've been here before. That numb stage where we smile at each other and just never mention where I sleep at night. You get older, you grow apart, and you end up falling asleep on the couch to the TV every night. Married life isn't all romance and glamour. This is just reality. I thought he was the one, and now my own husband doesn't even seem to want me. But maybe this is it. Maybe this is all there is. Maybe this next girl will be the one. The one who'll love me for me. The one with no expectations. No demands. The one. The one. The one. The one. The one.